So I would say, well, let's, you know, I'll try to take a picture of the flood uh, or the flood's consequences. How would you, Chris, um, think about it as a visual storyteller? How can you take a step back and what would you say to Tafaroler, knowing that this is very personal, uh, but then probably quite painful to have seen a community affected by these floods that are growing in frequency, probably due to the effects of climate change. And as a health worker, having to be on the receiving end of people whose health is damaged by the floods, uh, in some cases, uh, losing their lives. What would you, if you could sit down with Tafa Roder, what, what we can't do here, but what we'd like to is sit down, have coffee together, share a meal together with Tafa Roder. What would you tell her? What would you like to, what would you ask her? What would be the questions you would ask her to consider in order to figure out what she can actually take pictures of to powerfully tell the story of the floods that are being driven by climate change and that are impacting uh, the health of the community that she serves? Wow. I would love to have a meal with, with her and, and talk about this. And uh, maybe we should. <laughs> um, so um, what is very, very important uh, with, with these really big, big topics is that you make it small. You make it 